She's accused of stealing from the senior citizen she was hired to help. Tonight, this caregiver is on the run, and police want her caught before she's hired again. And it tops Local 4 News at 6. It is a case that will have a lot of people shaking their heads. That's right. Police say the victim in this case is a quadriplegic senior citizen whose credit cards disappeared along with his caregiver. She's now a wanted woman. Local 4 defender Mark Santia joins us now with more. And Mark, what a disturbing case. And Carmen, you may find this more disturbing. Not only is this woman on the run, but police tell the defenders they believe she is still in the health care field and she's still making house calls. Take a good look at this woman, Kelly Todd, a wanted fugitive accused of stealing thousands from a 78-year-old St. Clair Shores man who's confined to a wheelchair. Justice. Uh, you know, if something like that happened to somebody in my family, I would just like the law to follow through and justice to prevail. With elderly relatives, Antonia DeLuca is concerned about Todd being on the run and still working in the health care industry as Todd now faces allegations of bilking an elderly man she was trusted to care for. Very concerned. You know, nowadays, elderly get taken advantage of uh, very often. Uh, and with people like this on the run, uh, it, it just brings up concern because they easily get taken advantage of. Detectives say Todd took out credit and debit cards in her patient's name, then bought furniture and other items in Livonia, Dearborn, and Chesterfield Township before skipping out on her arraignment and becoming a fugitive. And tonight, if you have any information about Todd, you're asked to call St. Clair Shores Police immediately. Reporting live in Macomb County, I'm Mark Santia, Defenders. Mark, the 78-year-old man who's confined to a wheelchair, did you speak to him about this fugitive? Well, Carmen, I spoke to his family, and they told me on the phone today they hope, they hope someone watching right now comes forward, calls police. They say they want this woman off the street before it happens to anyone else. You can certainly understand it. Our Mark Santia reporting for us live.